Uh, let's see. Game of Thrones House Targaryen prequel is in the works. Yeah. So more backstory about the incest loving cousin brother <laughs> fucking dragging people. <laughs> Tar- Yo, Targaryen is a dead ass like the rednecks of like Westeros. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want it you don't want, you want it? it yo but you get to see the mad king yeah well n- you, can- won't, you won't uh, um, you won't is it because of the ending mm-hmm. but it's a whole new series I fuck i know how it ends now <laughs> i know where it goes well you won't see the mad king though it's like 300 300 years care. back well, they, like they, they got dragons how, and how then conquered everything then dragons leave and now then fucking the wheelchair nigga becomes king <laughs> <laughs> So you're for, tell- all for not. So you telling me you're not gonna the watch the fucking faceless assassin doesn't go faceless or assassinate. <laughs> <laughs> all but for you, not. But you gotta be. You, you're not the rightful true heir king. Doesn't even touch the throne. For <laughs> not. Okay, but do <laughs> <laughs> but do we know George R. R. Martin's involvement in this one? Because you know this gives him time. Okay, so what we know from what we've seen on TV is not the actual ending of the true Game of Thrones shit. So we can yeah. read the book and get a totally different ending, but oh, we, we don't are. know if George Martin is going to have any input on this, if, if he's going to have, you know, some say on how this is supposed to go. Is it supposed to stay true to the book? I think the only way it ended the way it ended is because the books weren't finished at the time. I mean, But yeah, being but... that, you know, George Martin has a in stone backstory of like the Mad King and what happened and what happened with this and how they took over and whatever... It could stay true to the book, and it could be something that you see on screen, and, and it plays out better than the book. I mean, look, am I going to fucking watch it? Yes. Am I going to be happy so about it? what the fuck is you talking about? <laughs> I'm going to look at it, but I'm not excited for it. I'm not like, oh, my God. So you're telling me when the shit come on, we're not going to review it. I'm going to look at it, and if I enjoy it, I'll keep watching. But if the second, I'll be like, nah, nah. All right, nah. I'm with it. If if it's, if it gets to like the second or third episode, and we like, nah, we ain't with it, then we nah. just stop talking about the shit. But I'm like, <laughs> fucking. But nah, you ain't gonna fucking like Wheelchair disregard the, the first yeah few f- seasons I'm, I'm, of fucking Game of Thrones just for this last <laughs> bullshit. No, right? but I'm like, but my excitement for Game of Thrones has like dwindled. Yes, because it's like I know, and also in general, I don't particularly care for prequels. I really just don't because they because if you you know they have to reach a certain point for certain things to happen to be a certain way, right? And it sort of. I don't know. For me, it ruins things a little bit, like to a certain extent. Obviously, like, you could watch the journey or some stuff, and but finally, but he, like it's like, oh, I I know this character has to get to this point, and this nigga has to do whatever the fuck because this is what he's yeah. But there's so many this. other characters, so many other backstories that we need to see. Yeah, and then granted, this is like what three hundred years in yeah, the past. Yeah, yeah. Mad in the past. So it's like they have a little bit more free range. But in general, I just don't really like prequels. And then it's like. Don't even look at it as a, it, that's the thing. Don't look at it as a prequel. Oh, look at it yeah. as a separate story from like this is a whole nother <laughs> lineage. I mean, not right, not, right. not fucking lineage. Like, 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 like a whole it. nother separate <laughs> story of the shit. I right, now you're right. I'm wrong. Like if them niggas got <laughs> mad, you know all them dragons that was underneath fucking Cersei uh castle and shit that they was keeping track of. Like oh, I got the head of this one, the head of this one. Yeah. It's like yo, I mean dragons was back then they was fucking Fas- shit up. Da. Nigga, yo. I'm 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 with not it, like guys. excited, but yeah, like some, I'm not some, excited. That's that's not like some shit that I'm like counting down the days. Yeah, like, I want to see the shit though. But it used right. to used to be super excited for Game of Thrones. That's because they ruined the shit. These fucking dickheads ruined the shit. Now you like yeah. I don't even fucking care about because like, now the wheelchair niggas the king, the king <laughs> wheelchair, the nigga who didn't want it. It's now the king. But that's not true to the book. <laughs> no, the king. You know the king. <laughs> The nigga didn't want it. <laughs> he didn't want it. <laughs> he didn't want it. <laughs> now he the king. Oh. <laughs> but, I mean, we, we go through this shit with Marvel. The true uh is not on the throne. But we go through this shit with Marvel and the MCU, with, with like the comic books and the MCU. We go through this the same shit. The faceless assassin did not assassinate. Because the, the whole, like, I saw so many and fan And then she just theories. went on a boat and went, woo. <laughs> I saw so many fan theories like yo Tony didn't have to die for this shit you could have gave this shit to Black Panther and Black Panther's <laughs> suit absorbs energy so he could have took all that. this shit I know. and that just probably did the shit <laughs> and then but that's a good that's an excellent fucking point it is built to absorb energy and then you got Thor in some part of the comic where he was supposed to lose his arm where it was like Thor could have took the fucking uh, gauntlet and did the shit and lost the arm and been armless Thor this nigga took a fucking sunbeam to the oh, body yeah. or whatever fuck took the fuck. a fucking star <laughs> star to the body you tell me he couldn't to the joint <laughs> and you that. telling me you can't take a fucking stone from the cosmics? <laughs> he a dick, Marvel. <laughs> I didn't think it was in the works for Tony to die. 
Well, no, because I mean, just in general. No, nah, it was just a it was just a callback. If you think about it, you remember in uh, what was the first? He said you were, you wouldn't. He was like, yeah, you you're, not part, you're not the part. Well, make the hard, uh, yeah, to yeah, make yeah, the hard um, choice, or whatever, like whatever, like you wouldn't sacrifice yourself yeah, for other you people. Wouldn't do that. Yeah, and but he if, evolved to black. If we talking about what Hesh yeah. is talking about, like if you want to stay true, true to the comics, there's or, so much other shit that could have happened. Yeah, it's not even about being true to the comics. It's just about being true to what the fuck you established in fucking five other seasons, and then you fucking at the end make the wheelchair nigga who's. <laughs> adamantly said he doesn't want any type of responsibility he just wants to be a nigga sitting in the tree fucking seeing the future yeah. and uh, now nah, he the king and then that chick who can remove faces and use other people's faces and gently just swing and then, just, and then stab her in the throat and fucking kill her while she's sleeping Listen, don't, but she don't do that don't. ever in the whole goddamn goddamn why you spend fucking three seasons with the lights being in the area learning from the niggas to do the shit and she don't do the shit <laughs> Listen, I don't know what's up with the goddamn goddamn, <laughs> but the mere fact yeah. that it she happened... She didn't assassinate me another no nigga in the whole episode. <laughs> <laughs> the whole season. God damn. Yo, you mad at me. I ain't do that. <laughs> I'm just mad at life right I, now. I'm sorry. I God shit. damn. That's why we need to write our own shit and we need to come with our own... <laughs> and I'm not saying endings. I can write better. I'm not saying I can do anything no. better. I'm not a writer, no, but I'm just I've saying... Heard at least 10 fan theories that have been way, way better. better yeah. than that shit. I'm just saying you spent so much time building it up like it was an important integral part of things and you do nothing with it. They <laughs> spent all that time with Jon Snow being a goddamn motherfucking true air king and they don't do shit with it. <laughs> Dog, I was there. I know. For the fuck why? <laughs> Yo, if I had an answer for you, Hey, come on, you need a hug, man? <laughs> I do, but not because of this fucking show. <laughs> All right, so we're going to move on. So Game of Thrones, House of Targaryen. I'm going to watch it, though. <laughs> <laughs> if I could crack this bottle over your motherfucking face. 